brothers. There was me, that is Alex, and my two elfnicks, that is Twinkie and Dinky. We sat at the North Pole eggnog bar, trying to make a plan of what to do for the evening. The eggnog bar sold different kinds of milk, regular, 1%, soy, non-fat, which is what we were doing. This would sharpen you up and make you ready for a bit of the old ultra excitement. Like a bit of the old nyak 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 doink woo 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 woo. So we elf next beat a hasty retreat. Stage left. Be careful, we'll be on the naughty list. Alex, I'm sure I'm tired. I know what'll wake us up. Disrespectful simpleton who doesn't know the true meaning of Christmas. Because I don't like that stupid song. That stupid song is Christmas. You don't even know anything from Christmas. All you just like is the tunes. You wouldn't know Christmas from Judas Priest. Or Megadeth from Metallica. Well, maybe Metallica. But not Sepultura. Alex, I'm getting really tired of you. You just bully us, all of us, and we're all sick of it. Easy, my elf, Nick. You're just delirious. I'm not your elf, Nick. I'm Santa. Santa! You listen here, you listen good, Dinky. You're my elf, Nick. Reason why? Because I'm the leader. Without me, you'd just be a rejected elf, Nick. It's because of me that you're a popular elf, Nick. So be grateful that you're hanging out with me, okay? I'm sorry to snap. I'm just tired, right? Right. Right. Listen, Alex, we enjoy your company, but... But what? We want to change things up a bit. How so, Twinkie Boy? Well, we don't want you to be the leader anymore. The both of us took a vote and we think I should be the leader. Think he's in second command. And you're approving of this, Dinky? And no more bullying this one! I've taught you well, Elfnix. Tell me, uh, as our leader, what you had in mind for us, Twinkie Boy. As we walked outside of Santa's workshop, I was calm on the outside, but thinking all the time. So now it was to be Twinkie, the head Elfnix, 
saying what we should do or what we should not do, and Dinky as his mindless grinning reindeer. But suddenly I thought that thinking was for the dumb ones like Twinkie and the smart ones like yours truly use inspiration. And come inspiration did, for now it was lovely music that came to my mind. There was a window open with the radio on, and I thought it right at once what to do. the way they were, right? Right? Right. So I was head of the Elfnix, and everything was as it should be. Hit me. Ah. What shall we do tonight, my Elfnix? What sort of damage? What happened to your eye? Oh. <coughs> oh. and you get put on the naughty list, you are no longer an Elfnik. You could be banished from the North Pole, though there was an experimental program where Elfniks could maybe be turned from naughty to nice. And that, my brothers, is where dear Alex ended up. Each morning, the nurse Nicks would give old Alex a poke with a big, big squirty needle. At first, it would feel all warm and tingly-wingly, but also a little sicky at the back of my gob. And then, they took me to the picture show. They wanted me to video some of the old movies. I loved old movies, so I thought this was ultra heavy. What they showed me was a film of the old ultra excitement. Brats being naughty, doing things that would earn them no Christmas gifties. And in the movie, they were playing my favorite music, Christmas carols. And I was thinking, this cure was very, very good. But as I was watching this, I started to get sick. So sick that I thought I was going to throw up. I began to scream. Ah! Ah! Stop it! Please, I beg you! It's a sin! It's a sin! It's a sin! Sin? What's all this about sin? Playing Christmas carols while showing me this film! Christmas carols? Are you referring to the background music? Yes! <laughs> So you like Christmas carols? Yes! Hmm, he's clearly not getting the difference between naughty and nice. I'm sorry, Alex. We're going to have to continue showing you these films. But sir, I've seen that it's wrong. I'm cured. I'll never do a naughty thing ever again. I'm cured. Just don't do this to me. It's horrible. Yes, it is horrible, Alex. Being naughty is horrible. You're learning that. Your body is learning that. You're going to have to continue learning for a few more days, Alex. They showed me more films. Each was worse than the last. It was starting to get to the point that I felt like throwing up. Watching all the naughty things these little brats do. Being ungrateful and then they're crying and disappointment. And all the while that music, that music. Eventually the movie stopped, and then it was time for another kind of test. Ho ho ho! Welcome everyone!
everybody to tonight's test performance. We'll be testing a dear elf named Alex who had been on the naughty list. But if tonight's test is a success, he'll be on the nice list and be able to go back out into the world. Let the test begin! Ho, ho, ho! What can I do for you, my dear elf? What did you do for my good elf? Because I ain't naughty, but you are. Yes, I am, but I'm trying to get back on the nice list. So if you could please stop hitting me and get out of this. Instinct made my wee fisties clench up for a bit of the old ultra excitement, but oh my brothers, I could not strike a blow. That sicky feeling in my gut stopped me. Strike I would, but I could not. Alex, you have succeeded! Welcome back to the nice Excuse place. me! Yes? You? But he is a cure, and he shouldn't be put back on the nice list. He's still naughty! If he was naughty, then he'd be sick. That's why he started to cough when he tried to take that cookie. He's like, like a clockwork Christmas cookie. The eggs and the sugar and the flour are like organic, but he has no free will. That makes him like a wind-up toy. A bad wind-up toy cookie thingy. Ah, shut up! He's a hundred percent cured! My elf Nix! My elf Nix, you lock me in! You're not nice. You're just not able to be naughty. No, 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 you don't understand. I've changed. I'm a new elf Nick. No, you are not, and it's time for your come up it. Suddenly I saw what I had to do, and what I had wanted to do, and that was to do myself in, to snuff it, to blast off forever out of this wicked, cruel world. One moment of pain, perhaps, and then sleep, forever and ever. I jumped, oh my brothers, and I fell hard, but I did not snuff it, oh no. If I had snuffed it, I would not be here to tell what I have told. I came back to life after a long, black, black gap of what might have been a million years. Here you go, Santa. Anything else? No. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you. Oh, well, Alex.
Alex. That's quite an injury you've got there. How are you? Oh, uh, I'll survive. Good, good, good. <laughs> well, uh, I just want to tell you how sorry I am about the elves getting out of control. Yeah, and I, I just want to tell you I'm deeply, deeply sorry about that horrible prank they pulled on you. I've worked with you, Alex. I, I know you're cured, but the elves, well, they think you still belong on the naughty list. <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, the joke's on them, Alex. <laughs> because they're all on the naughty list for what they did to you. So, you, Alex, are the only nice elf. Yes, you, yeah. Well, again, I'm sorry. Also, Alex, um... Do not let yourself get put back on the naughty list. You do understand me, Alex. Am I making myself clear? As clear as clear, Santa. As clear as the sunrise on Christmas morning. You can trust her. Good. Good. Oh, 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 well, I hear you're a fan of music. I've got a little surprise for you. Surprise? Yes. A little, uh music as a thank you for getting back on the nice list. And a nasty surprise it was. Christmas carols. I braced for the sicky feeling and the agony. But lo, come it did not. There was nothing but peace on earth and mercy mild. I was cured. Oh, prepare.